Hello, today's devotional can be found in John chapter 6 verse 39. And this is the Father's will which hath sent me, that of all which he hath given me I should lose nothing, but should raise it up again at the last day. Okay, Heavenly Father's will included having an atonement that would raise us up all from the fall and be able to reconnect us with Heavenly Father. And of course Christ volunteered for the plan, knowing that what would come. And he had nothing to lose. Jesus Christ had nothing to lose by coming to earth. <clears throat> and eventually allowing himself to be killed for the sins of the world. He really had nothing to lose. Because he was resur he resurrected again three days later, on the morning of the third day. He is infinite because he laid down his life and was able to pick it up again so that we might be able to lay down our lives someday and pick them up again. All of us will be resurrected according to the Father's will. Nobody will be forgotten that doesn't want to be. See, the Father's will is to, the Father's work and glory is to bring to pass the immortality and eternal life of man. And through the plan of salvation and the atonement, we can have both. Through the atonement we have immortality, we will be resurrected. We can remember that we're children of God and work to live up to that. And the plan of salvation provides us with opportunity to earn the best eternal life possible through our commitments and our preparations. Because through those covenants we make and, make and keep and the ordinances we undergo, we come to understand what we can enjoy in the best kingdom of glory possible and that we can enjoy it with our families. There are other kingdoms, but all kingdoms depend on our level of preparation. How long we waited to give our sins to Christ before we started preparing to improve ourselves. We shall lose nothing but our sins, and we don't need them. And we shall be raised up at that last day, like Christ, and be given opportunity to have rest in our holiness. And even now we are losing nothing but being holy. And because of the Father's will, we can remember our value and help others remember their value that all may be able to come unto Christ and find healing and strength in his atonement. Don't be afraid. We've got nothing to lose. <laughs> We really don't. The worst thing that can happen to us is if we die, is we die, like mortally. But there's so much life beyond death, without all the pain that comes with having a mortal body, so... We've got nothing to lose by being peculiar, peculiar in this life and striving to be as holy as we can be. We shall be blessed for all that we endure in this life. That's one of God's promises. And with that said, I love you all so very much. And I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.